All right, folks, sorry for the delay getting back here with the coverage, but uh, had a little bit of a breakdown. You can see on the left there on 27 and 28. Uh-oh, here comes Simo to shoot straight at it. They would chop the, the four off the eight every time. So fast forward 30 years, and now you have Simo. I mean, how often do you leave four through the nose? But he's like, well, just do the same thing. Just throw back a ball at it. Changing the game, Simo. Come on. Well, Pete has won the U.S. Open in this building. His last title, as well as his last major, came in this building. from three cities over with a pillow on top of his head. Spending the night in Anderson, he'll find you. <laughs> Creeping up a little bit. Players outside the cut on B squad. Nathan Rusla Joy plus 17. Toby Sambueno plus 15. Bill O'Neill dropped to plus five after that 164. DJ Archer minus 19. Let me ask you something, JT. There's a couple times you've mentioned uh, the word touch in, re in reference to, you know, the bottom of the swing release. Uh, for players, I'll give my guy rep uh, a shout out. He mentioned it. We were talking about, uh, or he was talking about Francois earlier today. Is, and I think with bowling, because you got this big heavy ball and you got to throw it and you got to put rotation on it. But think about it like like a, a quarterback in football. You know, absolutely wicked break that Wesley Lowe got right there. That was nasty. But yeah, I'm close, and can I just do something a little different with my hand, come out of the, the finger holes in just a slightly different position, rotate the ball just a little more, just to give it that little extra pop that I need to, to go from leaving ring and tens like Simo just left there to, you know, going through the pins right and striking. And speed control just a little bit to get the ball to do what he wanted it to do, pick up in the right spot. Walter Ray was, was ridiculous at it. Uh, Norm Duke, Pete Weber, uh, Belmo has incredible touch, just able to 